Hello, Cancer. <laughs> Welcome to your May update. All right, Cancer, let's dive in and see what wants to come out for you. Let's look at the energy surrounding you at this time or whatever wants to come through. I'll get a message and you just tell me who I'm reading for because I always want to know who I'm reading for. Take a look at your other placements to get a full picture, Cancer. And take what resonates for you. Leave anything that doesn't resonate for you for somebody else. All right. And if you haven't yet, I would love for you to, to subscribe and join my community here on YouTube. Okay, Cancer, what wants to come through for you? What do you need to know about right now? What do you need to know, Cancer? Let's see. Okay, the cards are being funky. Nothing is yet set in stone. What is this about? All right, we've got some cards here. I have this nothing is yet set in stone and your commitment is being tested here. So I kind of feel like you are, I also have luck is on your side, which I'm loving, and you're very close to achieving a goal. I feel like you're right there about something and it's something that you've been working towards something that you might have lost faith in. And so it says nothing is yet set in stone and your commitment is being tested because I feel like you've sort of lost faith. You've lost your, your faith, really. But what you don't see is that you are right there and luck is on your side. And so things are, there's something that's about to change in this situation for you. All right, you're right there. So it's your cards are telling you, let's reestablish your commitment. How bad do you want what you're what you're waiting for? How bad do you want what you, I feel like this has to do with a dream. You're right there. Dream or a goal, something that you're trying you're working towards and trying to achieve, but I feel like you feel like it's not going to happen. But your cards are like how bad do you want it? How bad do you want it, Cancer? Let's reestablish our commitment here. And let's see what the tarot wants to add to this, okay? I do see there's luck on your side, though. You know, we do have the full moon tomorrow at the time of recording this at tomorrow in Sagittarius, which this is Sagittarius energy, and it comes with Jupiter, which is the planet of good luck. So I feel like your luck is about to change. Cancer. That's what I am hearing. That's what I want to tell you. Your luck is about to change. Wow. Your luck is about to change. What can we tell you about that? Let's see what wants to come through. Your luck is about to change on something. Okay, so I've got the six of pentacles to get us started and the empress. Wow. Oh my gosh. And the eight of wands and the magician. And the king of pentacles here. You're about, you're about to see success. You cannot see it yet. But it's right there. It's right there. So you've got this breakthrough energy. You've got luck on your side. You've got two very powerful cards here with the empress and, and the magician. You're literally creating what it is that you want. You're creating abundance. You're creating success. You're creating yourself receiving whatever this is. You're about to get that breakthrough. You're about to see movement in this situation. You're about to see uh, things like whatever has been holding you back or whatever has been in the way, really get out of the way. And there's massive, massive movement forward here. You've got a lot of abundance. You've got this brand new beginning. There's something breaking for you here with Venus entering the picture right now. And I feel like she's, you know, she's Venus energy. So I feel like that's tied to your reading. It's really in the planet of good luck, Jupiter. There's something breaking through for you here that is going to push you into massive success. You may have had to do a bit of healing on the inside. Maybe you've been forced to wait for some reason because there was some sort of 
lesson that you needed to integrate or something and now it's like we've got some breakthrough energy and we have a new beginning with the magician here this is com communication maybe you just you've been waiting for a phone call and you get that phone call and it's all systems go but you literally are it's what you want it's what you want I wonder though if it's bigger than you think because that has been a repeating message that I've been getting for the collective for a while because these are very very successful energies very very successful doors opening for you fast movement forward we got a lot of success here I feel like for you cancer this could have to do with love but I feel like for for you it's going to resonate mostly for some sort of success in your business or a uh, new job maybe something having to do with your finances really there's a huge breakthrough that you do not see coming it puts you in a seat of leadership high level success this is bigger and better than anything that you have seen or done in the past but it is a brand new beginning you've literally been waiting for this but you were losing your confidence you are getting the success you're getting the victory here this is a victory card it's been a battle that you've had to to face you've had a battle i feel like internally mostly maybe you've had a lot of chaos a lot of conflict going on in your life and it caused a lot of conflict on the inside too really doubting yourself and doubting your ability whatever this is that you've been working towards I feel like you you were losing some confidence you were losing your strength there for a while and but you're about to get it back because you're about to have the breakthrough that you've been waiting for you're about to like things are about to align for you So let's look. Wow. Yes, things are about to align for you, Cancer, in a big, big way. So find your courage, find your strength, find your power. Step into that power. You know the truth. You know, you know you're deserving and worthy of this. This is something that you literally you you've known for a long time that you're gonna find a way to succeed. You're going to find a way for this to take off. You're going to be okay. You are stepping into a higher version of you in this higher like authority and leadership of your life. You're making difficult decisions. You're making better decisions. You're coming from a place of logic. You are coming from a place of being grounded and being logical. It's shifting you forward. There's something shifting here. So I feel like you're, you really find your confidence. You really find your strength. You really know, you know what you want. And you're like, you know what? No, I'm not, gonna, I'm not going to let my circumstances get me down anymore. I'm going to stand in my power and I'm going to make this happen. And guess what? You do. We've got movement here. We've got a brand new opportunity coming in here. This is being handed to you by the universe, whether this is you moving towards towards whatever this is for you, or this is the breakthrough moment that you needed to move forward, or this is you following your heart, or this is some sort of offer coming in for you. Whatever it is, you're moving forward now. We're looking at the May update you're moving forward now so this could be past energy some of you may have already received whatever offer or something this is it's a new start in some way and it makes you feel overflowing happy and look at what else I have here the ten of cups this is your fortune after difficulty this is everything coming together for you you're feeling so much more strong peaceful confident you're going in a you know you're going in a direction that brings you peace that brings you balance that feels so much better than the conflict of the past that you've been going through in this last cycle you're literally moving out of that it's like you're moving out of the storm and you're coming into calm waters you're coming into things feeling so much better <laughs> you know falling into place and feeling like I have finally made it I have finally made it 
This is great energy. I'm so happy for you. You literally are overflowing with happiness, confidence. You're following your heart and you're and you are happy. You are making things happen and you're finally coming to a close with that last cycle that you've been in. Take what you've learned because you've learned a lot. You've learned a lot that you're gonna need in this next chapter. Maybe that was the whole pur purpose because you know the universe allows us to go through things to really put you in your power like never before. And closing that old chapter and moving in a new direction, you've got breakthrough energy that is literally breaking you through and thrusting you forward. You are going to love it. You're following your heart and you're standing in your power and you're making better decisions and choices that are really paying off. Now, if this is love, I've got a, a perfect alignment here. A divine alignment here I've got a love offer coming in I've got the ace of cups and I've got the ten of cups I'm telling you there's some major big love situation brewing for you as well so if you are looking for love or if you're single um, these two are single energies and but they're a divine match you're coming into a divine alignment you may be coming into a divine alignment with your person and a business opportunity or a successful conclusion to something in a job, um, coming into alignment with a new company or a new job, whatever it is, I'm feeling both. There's love and money here. And I feel like you have a breakthrough in both. So whatever this is, it could be a business taking off. A lot of times I get the energy with this card, I, I feel like it's talking to me about a business taking off. You're about to be super busy. So if this is a business situation for you, you've got some breakthrough energy here. It's going to relight your fire. It's going to relight your confidence. It's going to relight your sense of passion and purpose and whatever this is for you. You are, can, it's like it's going to relight your flame and your sense of childlike enthusiasm. You have a you have this, it's going to relight your faith. In the beginning, we talked about you maybe losing faith and losing hope and losing your confidence. You get a re-spark happening here. There's a re-spark. You're going to feel alive again. And you're moving forward in a big way. We've got, I mean, some major players here. This is abundance, but it's also the divine feminine. You could be receiving your divine counterpart this month, maybe meeting them or reuniting with them. And literally, you're getting, I want to say, I feel like you're getting everything that you want, Cancer. You're getting everything that you want this month, or very soon, because we're talking about a May update. Wow. The Ten of Cups here. It's like you, you feel like everything is falling into place for you. I literally feel like this is love and money. So whatever your love situation, it's like it's, it's falling into place. It's coming together exactly the way that you need it to in a healthy way, a balanced way, a fulfilling way, because somebody needed to know their worth and maybe you needed to, maybe you're single. This is just another single energy, but maybe you had a separation and you're coming back together and you're finding success in your love life but you're also finding success in your business life or your career or your finances. There's love and money here. And there is your new chapter just like totally falling into place. Everything is literally falling into place for you. Everything is working out for you. Everything is so good for you. You have so much good energy here, so much movement and new beginnings. Wow. Did I not call it divine alignment? You've been through a lot, Cancer. You've been through a lot, but you're coming out of that. You're coming out of the pain from the past and everything, one challenge after another, I feel like. You're coming out of that and you're stepping into your power. You're stepping into your power and life is about to change for you in such a big way. 
in the way of love and money. It's all coming together for you. I cannot believe these cards. <laughs> like literally, it's all coming together for you. I want to say that this is all about love and money for you, Cancer, but like if you're not looking for love and maybe you are all about your finances or a business or something, you are embodying both the divine feminine and divine masculine. You're, in, you're embodying your full potential, your full power. You're stepping into your full power, your highest version of you, and you're making it work for you and creating this incredible success in your life and contentment and like financial freedom and peace and joy and contentment. Legacy stuff. Amazing. But if you are looking for love too or an improvement in your love situation as well as money and feeling good about your life, it's all here. It's all here. So whatever you've been through here in the recent past, Cancer, I feel like you've literally learned some lessons that are changing your life because literally I see that you are learning something and you're using that to your advantage moving forward. Maybe you had to go through a a tower moment or many tower moments to just crumble your foundations so that you could rebuild to a bigger, better version of you. And yeah, it sucked going through it and it it really tore out your confidence and maybe blew out your light for a while and you were feeling like life maybe was never going to turn around and now it's about to turn around and now you are about to see success beyond your wildest dreams in all areas of your life cancer I am so excited and I'm a Cancer Moon so I'm a little excited for myself right now too because I would like to claim this reading. <laughs> I'm so happy for you Cancer. Comment below and let me know how this resonates for you. I always want to know who I'm reading for and I would love to hear from you. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next reading. Take a look at your other placements too to get a full picture.